What up everyone, I'm Adam and today I'm going to be showing you my stats just before I prestige. So, I'm level 55 right now, as you can probably see, uh, I'm commander. And uh, I'm going to show you all my stats, classes, challenges, all that sort of thing. So, um, I think to start off with, um, score streets at the moment, I'm rocking the UAV counter and the Cerberus. Usually I would like go with like... Um, that or something. If I'm going for like a high get high kill game, or maybe for a nuclear, or I quite like that actually. The VSAT isn't as good in this game because you can be shot down, which is really unfortunate because it was really good in Black Ops 2. Um, classes. At the moment, I've got a KN class because it's it's a really good gun. It's a really good all-around weapon. Grip, stock, and quick draw. They're like the three base attachments you want for any assault rifle. And the perks they kinda of like differ slightly. On Black Ops 2 I would like choose a perk loadout and use that same one over and over and over again. But because I play free for all I'm using Dead Silence and because I got headset I use awareness. So those two match 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 each other perfectly. Fast sounds to aim after sprinting and sixth sense because it's got like the red radar thing. And then they're just standard. Man of War, I love this gun. A lot. Um, I've, yeah, I've got the integer camo. I need like a hundred headshots before I can go for gold. Dante's a really good camo as well. I'm gonna put that on actually. I quite like that. Um, Elo sight. I'm just messing around with sights at the moment. I'm not sure which one I prefer. On some guns, I like the reflex sight, and on some, I like the Elo sight. Because it's you got more vis more visibility, but the reflex is just because it's like it's been the best sight for a while now. Rapid fire increases the um, the rate of fire of the gun, so because this weapon is like long range-ish, it's not very good at close range. But with the rapid fire, you can like melt people at short range as well, and quick draw to bring up sights quicker. Now I'm using the MR6 because this this pistol is is really powerful. Like I tried to do a pistol only run the other day, and I actually ended up getting a hater. But I didn't. It wasn't good enough to upload, so I won't do that. Sixth sense scavenger because this you want to keep using this weapon a lot, so you want to replenish your ammo. So scavenger, and then these two perks because same reason as before. Cuda reflex sight, quick draw, and grip. They're like standard standard things, and the reflex sight gives you more precision. Mr. Six overclock because you get your specialist faster, and it's more fun when you do that. Scavenger, and then those two perks again. Um. MAA7 I only just unlocked because level 50, you get it at level 55. So I've only got a few attachments. Um, I want to get the stock because like you can move on the you can like strafe a lot better, but it's not as good as it was in Black Ops 2. I'm just gonna say that. MR6 reflex sight, quick draw grip, and then another perk loadout. And then ICR I haven't used this hardly at all. Uh, I used it quite a bit when um, I first unlocked it, but I don't use it as much now. Quick draw, grip, and stock, and then standard perks again. Um, what else can I do? I can do barracks. Here we go. Um, KD 2.41. That's been fluctuating up and down regularly. It was 2.5, then it dropped to 2.4, and then it was 2.45, and then be up and down. Now the win loss ratio is really disappointing because I like started off with like a 15 win loss ratio, but then I like there was a host migration and you get a lot of host migrations in the in the last gen. So kick me out of a lobby and like it just keeps doing that and it keeps it gets annoying because I wanted to keep it above two originally. Then it got above three and I thought okay I'll keep it above three now. But then all the host migrations it, they just kick you out and sometimes it's unplayable and it's horrible and. Um, Weapons. Um, most users the CUDA, 800 kills, 2.14 KD, Man of War. These like five are like standard. They're the ones I use a lot. VMP I use the uh, like that was my most used weapon when um, I first started playing. But then I just didn't like it. I just grew, like went off it, so I started using the CUDA more. Vespa. Eh, it's it's like a rushing gun, but it's not very good at long range. KN. It's a standard. Pharaoh I used once or twice, he says with the 433 kills. Yeah, I like it. It's decent, but in it can lead to a few unnecessary deaths if you don't play like if you don't hit all them bursts. And it's not it's not amazing at close range. ICR didn't use a lot, MA just unlocked, and then pistols and then 
all the weapons. Um, equipment, don't use equipment. Specialists, my most use is the Annihilate with most kills. 3.05 kills per use, that's pretty pretty good, that means I get like 3 on odd, odd 3 kills, 2 kills, maybe 4 if I'm lucky. Purifier, That this is like the best one to use, if you learn how to use this specialist, you can melt with it. Like, see what I did there? Um, vision Pulse, I use that a bit when... Um, yeah, it's the most, it's like almost, it's above the Purifier for most to use, but less like kills because it's like they see you and they run into you. Combat Focus I just started using, Rejack I don't really like, Tempest is a bit bad, and Scythe I used once. Um, score Streaks, um, UAV is the most obvious one at the top with 67 assists, and oh yeah, because I play free for a lot, that assist per use is going to be quite low, because I'm going to be the only one that like, benefits from it. Um, 286 used, 18 wraiths and 51 kills, that, that, that's a good streak. County UAV, these these top, I should know, the Hellstorms, um, County UAV like 62 wraps, I haven't used a lot. When I go for them, I like, they're a really good streak and if you put them with the wraith and they, you can like get a game win flawless if you get like 13 kills and got you streaks. 4 kills per use is really good. Uh, Hellstorm's bad. I haven't used that a lot. VSAT I only just unlocked because you, you get it at level 48. Cerberus I only just started using and then the rest are like weird. Game modes, free for all the most obvious one. TDM, look look at that kill KD ratio 1.96 and then I have like a 0.57 win loss. That's like bad teammates and weird algorithms to do with matchmaking and that. Medals, um, Da, da, da. Two frenzy kills, one super kill, triple kills, furies, 405 double kills, 40 mercilesses, 4 ruthless, and then like about 300 bloodthirsters, and the rest are just like score streaks in that. Leaderboards. Now, if I look at this right, hold on, weekly, all, I'm like a thousandth in the world. At the moment for free for all, but like a 2.43 KD average weekly. That's pretty good. Uh, oh, free run. Actually, no, I'm going to save that for another time. I'm going to save that for another time. Challenges. Um, near completion. Standard ones like wins, score, killers. Um, dark ops. These are really difficult. I've only got like four of them. Frenzy Killer, Super, I think one of them is going to be like the quad feed probably, and the other one's going to be like the, the kill chain or something. Calamity, yeah, these are really difficult to get. Um, heroics, I ain't got any of these because I don't play like other game modes. Victory is free for all, obvious. SMG and Assault Rifles, Streaks, and then the rest, like, oh. Um, 50 Merciless, I've got 40, so should be getting that soon. And the Prestige Challenges, which um, do we unlock next? I think that's it. I think that's all I've got to show you. So now we're going to go into where uh, to prestige. Start over at level one. Keep all progress towards weapon levels, challenges, and customization. Get an extra creator class and prestige awards. Let's do it. Prestige one. Enter prestige. Congratulations, you're now prestige one. Sick. So now we can ah oh, one permanent unlock refund. And, right, permanent unlock now. Um, we get the early, so there's no point. Get the early, so no point. 46. Um, no, nah, actually, no. Nah, I'm not going to do that. Weapons. Now you get the um, M8 really late. Uh, no, no equipment. Now nah, I use six cents and overclock anyway, so they're early. Scavenger's like scavenger's quite late. Um, Dead Silence, I could use, that's the latest perk so far. And then Wild Cards, and Hater, the, the VSAT 48. I don't know, it's difficult. Um, it's between the uh, M8, Dead Silence, and the, the VSAT. I don't think that's that, this isn't that good of a gun as it was in Black Ops 2, so I think I'm going to go ahead and unlock. Dead Silence, because I'll use it a lot. 
So, is that it? Have we got it? Yeah, we've got Dead Silence. So we keep our uh, challenges. We go Prestige 1, Level 1. What's the Prestige challenges? Um, oh, wow. So we get... Oh, did we get... Oh, wow. That We get extra challenges. Cool. So that can help us rank up a lot more. Uh, yeah, I'll stick with this one. This specialist. Yeah, Vision Pulse. <laughs> oh, well. I think I'm going to end it here. We've got six classes now, so... Uh, if you enjoyed, don't forget to give it a thumbs up for more Prestige videos. I'll do it all the way to Prestige Master, hopefully. So yeah, if you enjoyed, give it a like, and I'll see you in my next video.